very important thing, man. That's one of the things we can kind of get into as we get to the CEO thought of the day, man, is honoring the people that don't quit, honoring the people that stay down. Man, I got a quick update to a story that we covered about um earlier this week. We was talking about the lady who um Tesla ditched on the six grand, sixteen thousand, right? Well, I got an update to that story, man. Let, let, let me bring that up. Yeah, we got an update to that story right here, man. Just update on some news that we brought for those that didn't know. This this small this small business owner. Yeah, the small business owner, a small black business in um California had a deal with Tesla to make sixteen thousand dollars worth of pies. They got four thousand pies and it costed sixteen thousand, but then they canceled on that at the last minute. And that pretty much is any small business that stressed the out that's that messed her up, right? To what she didn't know if she was gonna be able to continue because I mean that's a hell of a lick, man. I done made all these pies and then they canceled, and it's black history month. Well, she took the Facebook to talk about it and Facebook to share her experience and what she was going through. And then, bam, that's the beauty of social media, man. Elon Musk caught a hold on it. We reported on it on Monday. And here we are today, happy to report that Tesla repaid the bakery owner after the controversy canceled of 16,000 K order at the last minute. So they made good on that story, man. And that, and, and that is the definition of honoring people that never give up. And never quit. I'm gonna read the story real quick. It says after Tesla canceled a sixteen thousand dollar order for four thousand mini pies from the Given Pies Bakery at the last minute, the bakery owner faced significant losses, but confirmed Tesla repaid the two thousand she spent on preparations. The cancellation and the subsequently support from Tesla and the community showed the challenges small business faced. When dealing with large corporations, Elon Musk responded to the situation by promising to make things good with the bakery, leading to Tesla reversing the bakery. Yeah, man. So you just got to stay down, man. You can't quit, man. Business is hard. Business is hard. Business is a struggle, man. But you have to keep going. You have to keep performing. You cannot stop. You cannot give up. And those people that stay down are on it. That's why I always play that as the first commercial that I run here on the show. I don't know if y'all noticed that, but I always run that Nipsey Hustle first, right? Because the beginning of it is very significant. He's saying it right there in the thing, man. Like, I ain't done nothing different. I just didn't quit, man. And then that's why that commercial ends with honor the ones that stay down. It begins with not quitting, staying focused, being dedicated to something. And it ends with the ones that stay down get on it. And that's what happened in this situation, man. She stayed down. She stayed committed to what she's doing. She took her lick, but then her time always came back around, man. And I'm going I'm to I'm drop that beginning again, man. Let's hear that again. I'm not going to lie and, and, and portray um, this ultimate poise. Like, I've been, had it figured out. No, nah, I just didn't quit. That's the only distinguishing quality from me and probably whoever else going through this or mm -hmm. went through this or is going to go through this is that I quit. I quit. I quit. I quit. I quit. That's it, man. That's the only defin this definitive factor is that he didn't quit, man. Are you a person that's going to quit? Are you a person that's going to stay down? Are you a person that's going to ride out through through the tough spots, man? You know what I'm saying? You got to get through those tough spots. And then you also got to know where you get off at. You have to know when you don't know, right? And then you also have to know when to seek help. If she would have just cried, not on, got on Facebook and talked about it, not expressed what she was going through, she wouldn't have got no help because she expressed what she was going through and not faking and hiding like she's not going through something or like she didn't take a loss, right? She would have never got no help and she would have suffered in silence, right? It's a lot of people and a lot of business people that are suffering in silence because they have too much pride to get help, right? They have too much pride to ask for help. When the tools that you need to help you are right in front of you, you can't see them because your pride is in the way and you suffer. And everybody can see you suffering, but you can't see yourself. So staying down also requires you to understand how to ask for help. Staying down also requires you to understand how to go get help. Staying down also requires you taking inventory of yourself and realizing where your limits are at. That's all a part of staying down. And those that stay down, 
those are the ones we have to honor, man. And that's the CEO thought of the day. And that's just how we're going to play it, man. Salute to everybody that's staying down. Let's get it.